Click the quiz button in your main room page. Remember your main room page is the home page of Socrative with your name displayed at the top of the page. To launch a quiz, simply click over the quiz button. After we've clicked the quiz button, a new window will open up. In this window, we have to select the quiz that we've created previously or another one from our quiz library and then click the next button. In this window, we find a column on the left side in which we have three different options available. Instant feedback. Students answer the questions in order and are not able to change their answers after it is submitted. Instant feedback is provided to the teacher. Open navigation. Students answer the questions in order and they can go back and change their answers. You can live monitor their activities. Teacher paste. You can control the flow of questions and you can also decide to go back and revisit a question for your students. And you can also decide the timing of your quiz. We can choose the instant feedback option so when our students answer the question, they can then only move forward to the next question. In the column on the right side of the screen, we have different options to personalise our quiz and the way it is submitted to the students. Requires name. When they log into the classroom, a window will ask them to insert their name or another name to identify their answers. Shuffle questions. The order of the questions is random for every student. Shuffle answer. The answers options are in a random order. Show quiz feedback. You can decide whether to show the explanation text box. Show final score. The final score will be shown to each student. After we have customised our quiz, we are ready to start it and wait for the students to answer the questions. As you can see, each time the student gives an answer to one of our questions, we get the result in the teacher view chart on the left side of our screen. We can hide or show their names or answers. After the students have answered all their questions, we can download their results in an Excel file on our computer. Click the Finish button to end the activity and then select the Get Reports option. Now we can choose what we would like to download. The option Whole Class Excel will download an Excel file with all the results summarised in a chart. The option Individual Students PDF will download a PDF version of the test for each of your students with all their answers in it. The option question specific will download a PDF document containing all the students' answers for each specific question. We can now choose if we want to download them, send them by email or save the results on Google Drive.